the original project, this was based on used open sound control to receive phone accelerometer data and manipulate some audio visuals in Max. This version focuses entirely on crowdsource performance using Max's MiraWeb objects. MiraWeb opens a local WebSocket, allowing users to perform simultaneously in any browser from their phone or computer. While MiraWeb can pull accelerometer data as well, multiple phones seem to crash Max. Uh, this is because there's no easy way to control which users have access to what controls without creating some kind of custom script through Zebra, Zebra.js and Node.js, which is roughly what MiraWeb is built on. The Max patch tries to quote unquote idiot proof a musical performance by constraining the user input in a variety of ways. It locks all output to a specific key and mode. The chord multi slider can only output four chord diatonic progressions, and the drum machine can only output a grid of 16th notes. There's also some multi touch GUI options for controlling filter sweeps for the different instruments and some sliders for other tone controls. If I had to do this again as an installation, I definitely would have built my own version of MiraWeb using Zebra.js instead um, to have more control over how the system operates. A decent portion of mapping and scaling could be done on the server side instead before anything even reaches Max or Ableton. Still, I think MiraWeb is great for quickly implementing this kind of system, and I would use it as a down and dirty way to make these kind of installations in the future.